All right, so here um, we just did a quick review of uh, DNA. We reviewed the structure of DNA and, and, and labeled all the parts of the DNA. Um, so just a quick review then. Um, when we have a phosphate, the sugar, and a nitrogen base, that makes up a nucleotide. Um, so here we have our sugar labeled and a phosphate molecule labeled. And then we have our nitrogen bases. Um, this is a guanine for G. Um, we have A here for adenine. And then we know that guanine will always pair with cytosine. And um, adenine will always pair with thymine. And we're going to move on today and start talking about um, cell division. Um, last class, we talked about the two forms of cell division. Mitosis is where the cells will divide into identical copies. And then meiosis is um, cell division to form the gametes, so the egg and sperm cells. And we'll talk about uh, mitosis first. So mitosis is for the body cells. It does not include the gametes. Um, it's only for the body cells. Um, so anytime I talk about the body cells or I speak of somatic cells, um, it's the same thing. Somatic cells are um, the body cells. So cells of multicellular organisms, they divide for growth of the organism and also for repair and replacement of tissues. So if you get a cut or an injury, um, it is mitosis that is taking place um, um, to repair uh, the tissues. Um, some cells can last a lifetime, while other cells will only survive for only a few days. So if we look at this diagram here, we can see the lifespan of different um, human body cells. So for example, brain cells um, survive for about 30 to 50 years, our red blood cells can survive for about 120 days. Um, one second, let me just finish here and then I can answer any questions. Um, our stomach lining cells are about every two days they get replaced. Liver cells, 200 days. Um, intestinal lining is three days. Our skin cells are every 20 days. All right, so here, is mitosis occurring. So before a cell can divide, um, we have our chromosomes here. We have to um, replicate or duplicate um, the, the DNA. All right, so before a cell can start dividing, a copy of each chromosome is made. So here um, we have red chromosome, we have the bluish one, and it replicates, All right, So it has doubled here. Then the chromosome copies are divided in this process called mitosis. Now, when we watch the videos, it's going to get very, very specific and talk about all the phases that occur um, during mitosis. You don't need to know those phases for grade nine, but definitely um, it is interesting um, to see what happens when the cell divides. So what we can see here is cell division now occurring. Um, you can see that the cell has uh, kind of elongated and now it starts to kind of pinch off here um, in the middle and then it will completely separate and we have two um, cells here. Now these two cells are eventually called daughter cells and they are genetically identical to each other. Um, they look exactly the same as what we began with. All right, so next we will watch this um, mitosis video. It does get into a little bit more detail, like I said, um, but you are not required to know those phases for grade nine. 